Hello again and welcome back. Today I'm going to show you some sample parts printed on a HP Jet Fusion 3D printer. This is the latest and greatest state-of-the-art printer. Uh, I'm going to try to show you how impressive the parts are that come off of this printer. Uh, this uh, Statue of Liberty model here was printed and as you can see there is some incredible detail. In the crown, the points of the crown come to a perfect point. The torch quality, I mean just everything on here is fabulous. This comes out of the printer. We do a little post-processing work on it, a little cleanup work, and then actually comes out of the printer in this grayish black material. This part is then dyed. You do not have to have it dyed if you don't want to, but for most people I choose to dye it black. There are other colors available as well. Uh, as I said, the detail is incredible, but also the strength is incredible. I want to show you this part. This is just a piece from a sample part that we printed, and I'm going to try, and I did not rehearse this, so I want to show you the strength, of the, and this is a 3D printed part from the HP Jet Fusion. And as you can see, with all of my might, I cannot break this part. And you would think that that corner would be a natural break point right there, but it does not. Now I'm going to go really hard here and see if I can break this. So it does eventually break. That, for a 3D printed part, is incredible strength. Uh, as I mentioned, the incredible detail you can print as well. This sample part is chainmail printed on the HP printer. Comes off the printer, as I said, it's a little post-processing. It's printed in a bed of powder. Uh, you can see some photographs of this on our website. I will put the link with the video here. But this is printed on the printer and comes off. This is not assembled, comes off the printer like this. Just imagine what you can print on this printer. Uh, as I also mentioned, that it does print with support, so you can make things like live hinges, swiveled parts, bearings, etc. That function, this part came off the printer, we cleaned the powder out of it, we dyed it, and that is how it comes off the printer. Pretty cool, huh?